Hello and welcome to the Calculator Guide video, Introduction to Verify Mode. We're going straight into a question in this video, circle the equivalent expression to 4 brackets x plus 3. If you want to pause the video, you can have a go now. And here we have our answer, 4x plus 12. We're going to use the calculator's verify mode to check that we have circled the correct answer. Now to access this, we need to press mode. And the regular mode that the calculator is usually in is one, for computational mode. So press four to enter verify mode. We just have two choices of answer in this mode. Uh, it's either going to be true or false. Um, so what we need to do first is to input our original expression for, with the brackets then, x plus three. Don't forget to use alpha and right bracket to enter an x. Now we want to access the verify menu, which is here just above the number two. To do that, we need to press shift and then two. We need to do that rather than press equals at this stage. We do want an equal sign, however, so we're going to press one here to get an equals in the middle. I'll show you what happens if you press equals in the next example. Now input your circle answer to check that it's correct. 4x plus 12, now we need to press equals on the calculator. The calculator is displaying true, and this indicates that the following statement is true. Ideally, we could have an identity symbol uh, in the middle between them, rather than an equal sign. I'm just going to change it here using the replay button, uh, just to check out a common error that's often made, uh, not actually multiplying the second term. So we've got 4x plus 3 there, and this time it's saying false, which indicates that the following statement is actually false there. It's quite a common error uh, when people are expanding out brackets. We'll have a go at another question now. We're going to factorise x squared plus 6x. Pause the video now if you don't want to see the answer straight away. And here we have our answer. x and in brackets x plus 6. Now we're going to use the verify mode to check that this is correct. We're going to input our original expression x squared plus 6x. Now I'm going to show you what happens if you press the equals at this point. If you press equals, uh, then the calculator will automatically verify it as being equals zero, uh, which in this particular case is just going to give us false, it's not got enough information. But I can use the replay button to go back and delete the zero, and therefore I've got an equal sign there ready for me to put in my answer, which is x, and then in brackets, x plus six, to check that this is correct. Okay, when I'm done, this time I want to press equals on the calculator and here we have true indicating the following statement is in fact true. I'm just going to make a little alteration now another common error and hopefully it will reveal that this is in fact false. Uh, so a common error when people are factorizing is to just keep the second x or the, the x with the second term in there forget to factorize it out. And here we can see that x brackets x plus 6x is false. We've confirmed that it's the wrong answer. One last question to have a go at yourself. This time multiply out the brackets x plus 3 and x minus 7. Pause the video now if you want to have a go yourself. And here we have our expanded expression x squared minus 4x minus 21. I'm going to use verify to confirm that the answer is correct. I've inputted my two brackets and now I want to access the verify menu and I want one for equals and then I'm going to put in my expanded expression x squared minus 4x minus 21. As expected there, that says true, indicating that we've got the correct expansion. I'm just going to make a little alteration. Uh, another common error with these is to perhaps put in the wrong sign. So I'm just going to alter the sign for the 21 from minus to plus. And that tells us that this statement is false. Don't forget you can subscribe for future videos and you can follow the calculator guide on Twitter at Guide Calculator. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time on the Calculator Guide.